Mm. You're 33 and 22 Knicks. I'm By the way, we give the grade, just so you know, your Knicks are on for since y'all started that podcast with Jalen Brunson and Josh Hart, by the way. Well, see, there's no context behind that because then we've got like <laughs> seven people on injured reserve right now just sitting. Um, uh-huh. But I'll give them an A-. minus. I think, yeah, they've made a lot of good moves trade-wise and uh, they've built like a strong, deep team. But the depth is being tested right now with all these injuries. So uh, we need this all-star break badly. Uh, we need Randall back, OG. But, yeah, this this season is going great. I mean, we're I, okay. they deserve an A. They deserve an A. There's no way around it. They, they haven't – there's nothing they've done wrong outside of not trading Julius Randall already. Uh, they've done a great job. I feel a lot better about it if they trade. Yo, if they trade Julius Randle, I might get on the train, man. I'm serious, bro. I ain't got nothing to lose. But yeah, I get rid of him. I can't root for that guy. I can't stand Julius Randle, yo. I can't stand Julius Randle. The, 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 the early game against the Bucks on the road, where Dylan Brunson was cooking, and he and uh, Randle quit on the play because he, you know, he, I guess he wasn't playing well or whatever, you know. And Jalen Brown Brunson took a shot. I guess he didn't approve of the shot, even though he's cooking. What you what? What are you talking about? And Randall was awful. I I just can't get that out of my mind. I can't get the look on his face out of my mind. I can't get the way he walked back on defense out of my mind. And he's done it a couple times this year amidst them playing great, right? So they're winning, and he's still worried about himself. He's still worried about oh, I'm I'm not getting my points. Oh, this ain't. The, he's still in his bipolar. I'm sensitive to that stuff. You know, don't cancel me, but. Now I'm kidding. <laughs> he's still on that. So um I can't, a, I can't, I can't perennial, perennial all-star now. You see, here you go. He's the worst perennial all-star of all time. <laughs> That's know. what I'm saying. Yeah. He might be the worst <laughs> perennial all-star of all time. I've seen a lot of Knicks fans because things are going well. Trying That's to how, that how Knicks fans are, man. Trying to defend it, but I'm like, y'all forgetting very quickly he's not a good teammate i'm sorry i don't care what josh hart jalen brunson i don't know what gonna say say. enzo says i don't expect i can't see jalen brunson coming out in that interview anyway talking about while he's still on the team yo julius right he sucks as a teammate none Mm. of them are gonna say it but we can see the body language when his teammates are doing well and if he's having a bad game it'd be it'd be really telling Oh, DiVincenzo with another three, but he missed him. He missed Randall on the layup. Mm-hmm. Yo, it's, what is – It's nasty work. What does Shannon Sharp always say? He says, never accept anything in a win that you wouldn't in a loss. And that's what – Knicks fans will ride the wave. It, it's going well, but then it, the stuff he doesn't do, the stuff that Randall – that makes him – can make him cancerous to your team, it, it's going to rear his head in the playoffs. That's the problem. He, he – it, it, he or his play just decreases in the playoff. He's just, I'm, I'm really, really not hot on that guy. I get that he, you know, trading an all star doesn't make a lot of sense on paper, but if you can find a good enough deal, I would certainly entertain it. Um, I really, really would. I, but I know it, it's just got to be there. So he's in a team. It makes sense. They're not doing nothing wrong. The GM's putting up, been putting on a master class. Bogdanovich, Burks, you got him for nothing. You, you traded basically the the equipment manager, and you got those two guys to come back. That's a great trade. So you 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 can't you can't fault Rose and those guys. They're doing their thing. Um, I, I understand, but I just I'm not a fan of Randall. And I think if they're going to win a championship and become a serious like championship contender year after year, he can't be on the team. He can't he can't be there. He can't. He can't, I, I mean it. He can't. I, I you can't do that. I know this turned into a Knicks podcast out of nowhere. I'm just saying that you can't you can't do that. That's just my opinion. 